celebrating Africa's rich cultural heritage. The Grand Imam of Oshun State, Musa Anemashaun, has enjoyed Muslim faithful to use the occasion of Eid El Fitri to reflect on lessons and sacrifice during the Ramadan and make piety a habit as well as desist from sinful acts. Anemashaun gave the charge while addressing the congregations shortly after observing the two voluntary rakat at the Oshobu Central Eid in the state capital. The Grand Imam implored Muslims to consider at the beginning and end of the Ramadan period to ponder on the fact that there is time for everything and to always note that it is only God that is unchangeable without end. In his Eid elevatory message, the state governor uh, Demola Deleke, who is observing the two compulsory rakats at the Oshobo Central Eid for the first time since assumptions of office, cautioned the residents to celebrate the Eid El Fetri in modesty and moderation. He used the special occasion to offer prayers for the sustainable development, peace, stability, and unity in the state and Nigeria at large. After this Ramadan, they should know because we are all human beings. You know, it's only God that is 100 percent. We are not 100 percent, but they should try and abide from the you know fasting of that 30 days. You know, a lot of people stay away from a lot of things. They should try to abide, you know, by it. It's not going to be easy, but they should just try, and they should be more prayerful all the time. Because I know during the fasting, there's prayer every time. They should continue that prayer so I should can move forward. So as you can get to the promised land. Also, the Senate spokesperson, Ajibola Bashir, in an interview, speak on the essence of the occasion as he charged Muslims and other Nigerians to bring pearls and maintain integrity for a better society. The lesson of Ramadan is one for balance uh, and of course devotion to Almighty God and of course sense of sacrifice and of course commitment to spiritual development. So we pray that God will give us the wherewithal to continue with that I mean, spirit and to continue to walk in the path of Almighty God.